Hello and good evening. Welcome to Wednesday night. I am Leanne Winston, Psychic Medium. It's good to see people are coming in or have put their comments there early. So I hope everybody's staying dry and nice and warm. It certainly is a bit wet here and cold in Mount Barker tonight. So hopefully everybody's had a really lovely weekend or week so far. I know it's been a crazy week and things have gone rather quickly so far so all right so we do have some people here just popping in and saying hello um and i will get to your questions very shortly so what i do ask is for people just while i get myself organized and do the um housekeeping side of it i do ask for people to help me spread the love hit the button below that starts with the s the, the word we're not allowed to say here on um facebook is the entire the way they say we entice and entire people into it um so i do ask you to help me spread the love i'm gonna say it and um share with your friends and family please if you're watching from any other channel barn my time tv dot live you need to jump over there so if you're watching from leanne winston psychic medium um body mind and spirit the live hub or women in business um and stuff like that please the link is above you need to be on my time tv dot live for me to be able to see your comments as i can see them already starting to come in here as well hey ten and Tina and we have Raina here sorry honey if I said your name wrong and there are a few other people that I will get to as we go through now I do ask for people please do not ask general questions for just general guidance ask a direct question because I want to try to get to as many of you as possible so remember to help me spread the love if you're not on my time tv dot live you do need to jump over here keep the questions direct if you would like a card spirits tell me i need to get the cards out tonight i'm not very organized i've i've been uh, busy the last half now i've been creative on a little movie clip that i will share with you probably next week because it's still downloading at the moment I didn't quite have my timing right for tonight's show. But that's all good. If you want a card, please hashtag card. Also, don't forget to hashtag and let me know where you're watching from as well because it's really interesting to see where people are based. We are going worldwide. And I do just want to take that opportunity to say hello to those people watching on the Binge Network on Amazon for Amazon Fire and also those listening into the World Radio You know. Um, side of things as well so welcome and hello to everyone there you'll have to excuse my tiredness tonight it has been a long day it's been hectic and non-stop but uh, I do love it that way as well all right excellent so I can see Facebook has kicked in certainly oh there's the three three threes I love the way spirit give us the patterns in stuff so who's seeing the numbers let me know what it is that you see from spirit as well because certainly i'm noticing the patterns in the 111s um the 333s the 555s and the other one i did see the other day was the 777 i can't remember what that was on but um it certainly did catch my attention as well i think it was something to do with I was working on the computer where I seem to spend a lot of my time. Now, just before I do get into the readings, over the next few months, you're going to see me go through some changes. So things will be changing up in the way that I work, the way that I'll be, I'm doing my lives, my website, and a lot of different things across the board. So I'm really excited to be able to bring new changes in as we grow and change um, along this journey as well, because I think with everything we've been through, through this year it certainly is bringing change out with the old energy in with the new and I know spirit is moving me to move um pushing me to move forward and work in different ways so I'm really excited to to be able to put all these plans into place that have been going on the last couple of weeks um so keep your eyes peeled you will see that now I do know a fortnight ago when I was last live I spoke about setting up tickets for people to actually 
purchase to come on live and have readings with me. I'm looking at charging $15 for that. I'm looking at four people per show for a little mini reading sort of thing with that that will be obviously published live as well as I will still go through your comments in the background. But as time changes, you're going to see a few changes come in as well. So this this will be the first one. Um, things have been a bit crazy that I haven't actually set up the booking link and stuff. So I will have that up in time for next week's show as well. All right. So I do want to just remind people, please don't keep asking the same questions questions um because i i kind of get sick of the the same thing over and over there just seems to be a lot of cycles going on lately where the same people are asking the same things over and over even though that i've given you the answers the week before or in the last couple of weeks so i want you to stop and think what is it that you really need to know what is it that you need in this moment sort of thing. And also keep in mind, are you ready to hear that information as well? Because I can give a reading to somebody over and over and over and it be the same, but they're not always ready to hear what they what is needed to be said. So I really want people to start, start breaking the old habits and try to Look forward and think about what it is that you need in your life. Where is the guidance you're needing? You know, do you know the answers within yourself at the same time? Okay, because I really feel that spirit is pushing us to move forward and break these old habits and start to focus on us, nurture us. And I've been saying that for months, that we need to nurture us. We need to go back to basics. So I'd love to know where you're at in your life. What is it that you're finding that you're stuck on in the moment? At Boom here, I can help you work through that so you can move forward rather than just, you know, is there the same questions over and over in that sense, okay? All right, excellent. So... We have Sharon here saying, hello, I am well, thank you, honey. Just a little tired, tired and cold feet, but I'm doing well. I should have put the ad boots on before I started. Hey, Cheryl, I hope you're doing well, gorgeous. A uh, long time no see. So, and my mum is here watching as well. Good evening, mum. Uh, I hope you are having a lovely after evening sitting in front of the fire. A bit jealous i miss my fire <laughs> all right beautiful okay now who haven't i said hello to um vanessa is here as well uh should we yes vanessa i get yes to that honey all right so don't forget hashtag cards if you want a card reading if not ask a direct question um and i will get to it as many of you as possible just one last thing before i do jump into the questions please don't inbox me wanting free questions answered, okay? If you would like to have a question answered and you don't get it done on this show, I do in my calendar have one question readings that you can make a booking and I email you back the answer at the time of your booking, okay? Otherwise, you're, you're welcome to book a full reading, an email reading, face, um, a Zoom. Now, I am going to be stopping the face-to-face -face readings, so I am finding that it is a lot less preparation and it's a lot easier to do phone readings and Zoom readings rather than having people in my home sort of thing with that. Just with the changes my family's going through, I'm finding it being a little bit more difficult. I can still do the distant healings and stuff like that. The energy is no different whether I'm looking at you face to face, I'm answering your questions in the chat line here or I'm seeing you on a Zoom call where we can see each other. Now, the bonus for Zoom calls is I can actually record that reading for you and I can um, send you the link to that so you can watch your reading back at any time. When you have a reading like that here in person, I don't record them. Okay, so that is definitely a bonus with Zoom and you can be anywhere in the world and we can do that. So that is a great thing as well. All right, let's get started. Okay, so the very first comment I can see is Wendy. I know I have lost some off of the top of the post as well. So Wendy says, share the love. Are there any messages from my grandson, please? Now, honey, I do feel he is very much at peace. Um, I feel like I can't sit still with his energy. So as I can't, 
I connected with his energy. I just feel a little bit restless. So would I be right in saying always on the go, higher sort of vibrational energy in that way? I get a sweet little face, beautiful smile. So I do feel very loving in that way, okay? You sense him around you. So to me, it's a feeling things happen in the house and you think that it is him. I get trust that, okay, because I do feel that he he does things to let you know that he is very much around. I feel like the movement, the banging, the crashing in that side of it, okay. So um, lots of love to you, honey. Okay, so uh, Natasha says, share the love. Was there any messages for me from Spirit, please? Now, that is a little bit more general. So what I'm going to do, honey, is pull your cards. So I might not skip over the general ones tonight. I think I'm just going to pull cards for those. Same Spirit has got me having them out. Okay, so honey, I get the reference to there's news of something coming to an end. Um, the 27 breaks down to a nine, nine is endings, um, but I do get the reference to it will be in writing. But I also believe that that ending is something that is opening up new opportunities as well. So I get the reference to look at the excitement that will build around that. Okay, so wishing you all the very best there, honey, as well. Uh, Josephine says, share the love. Hi, Leanne. Hope you're doing well. Thank you, honey. Just like to know if you see buying a house this year. Yes, I do. If so, when, what area, and if you could describe the house. Oh, that's a lot of information, honey. Um, that's, so what I'm going to say is, yes, I do feel that you are going to buy the house. I get the reference to three bedrooms, and I feel like I've got a study on top of that. I feel like I'm within a 30-minute radius of where you are now, so I don't feel that you're too far away in that sense so not a huge move but far enough is the reference I get there so wishing you all the very best okay uh, that wasn't what I clicked on but that's okay all of a sudden my screen has taken off Need to, I think I was trying to click on Mel so Mel if you could write your question again hun I will uh, keep my eye out for that and uh, Nita says hi Leanne I hope you're well shared the love do you have any messages from my loved ones thank you all right I've got to grab another figure around you honey now I get the I, I know you asked a similar question most weeks um, but I just get there's a grandmother figure around you there's changes going on I get the reference to be patient and this energy will move quick um, fairly quickly and you will find a lot of positive energy coming with that so I wish you all the work all very well there as well hey Taylor she says hi Leanne I hope you're well I would also appreciate a message tonight anything regarding my love life thank you I feel like I've got changes coming in around the number seven with that honey so whether I'm looking seven weeks July sorry my knee has just jammed up on me and uh, seven weeks or the 7th of July or sorry, the 7th of the month, seven weeks or July, but I just get the reference to I feel I've got a positive change coming in around relationship. All right, so wishing you all the very best. Okay. Sharon says, share the love. I saw Craig today. This will continue to go well. Yes, honey, I do. Try not to overthink it. Go with the flow. Don't force things. Just be in that moment and enjoy it. All right. So wishing you all the luck, honey, there as well. Chloe says, hey, Leanna, how are you? I am good, thank you, honey. Shared the love. Do you have any messages from my pop or dad? I get they were both characters. I get cheeky energy between them with that side of it. Now, is it your grandfather, your pop, that liked to play with the cards? Because I just feel like with his energy that I need to be shuffling in that way, okay? I get the reference to they put me, you, okay, thank you. You get signs through songs, the music. So to me, it's a feeling there's stuff there or songs that come up that remind you of them. I want to say them, not just one. All right. So I get the reference to they find their way to let you know they are very much there. Okay. So sending you love. All right. Now, I do apologize if... <laughs> That wasn't the one I clicked on either. <laughs> the computer does seem to be running a little bit slow in responding on the button, but the, the feed is running quite um, 
quite quickly as well. So if I do miss you, please um, put your comment again um, and try to only ask one question as well, okay? I don't deliberately skip people. It's just that the, it's what the computer is doing tonight and sometimes the feed will move really quickly. Just while I'm on that, guys, please, if you're watching from any other channel, um, Barn My Time TV, you need to jump into mytimetv.live so I can see your comments here live in the background. If you're watching on Leanne Winston Psychic Medium or any of those channels, you will find I can't see your comments there um, tonight, okay? All right, Vanessa says, hi, Leanne. I hope you're well. Do you see me? Uh, see us getting a new car anytime soon? Yes. I actually feel like I've got within about eight weeks for that, honey. Um, I'd say look at the specials that are on. Cars seem to be a common um, sort of focus at the moment. My daughter got, well, my youngest daughter got her own car about a week ago. So, you know, exciting times and there's talks about other people getting cars too. Not me, but that's okay. I'm happy with my car. All right. So, yeah, the two is very strong, so I would save it in the next couple of months, all right? I get a car, it's going to be a good deal. Look at the, you know, with this virus, people haven't been buying cars, so they're reducing them as well as we've got the end of year, so I get it's a perfect time to do so as well. Okay. Uh, Raina says, I keep seeing the 1111. It's crazy. I mean, that just means spirits with you, Okay. And so um, just trust, believe, and just feel that gratitude that is around you and the love that comes through with them, okay? Beautiful. Brittany says, hi, Leanne, I lost my job yesterday. Will I get a new job in June? Yeah, honey, I don't feel there's going to be much of a standstill for you in that sense or any rest for you. My feeling is you'll get back out there quite quickly. And I also feel that I'm looking at something a bit different to what you've been doing. So think outside the square. Don't be afraid to push your boundaries because I get the reference to it is about moving forward, okay? All right, so I wish you all the best there. See that job that you want, honey. Okay, Rashina says, hi, Leanne, anything about my health, please? Um, there is burning sensation. I get look at feed with that, honey. I'm not um, picking up any warning bells or anything like that. I just feel there might be a little bit of an infection or something at the moment, but I get look at food. So whether you're reacting some to yeast or something along those lines, okay? So wishing you all the best. All right. Ah, Ruby, I've clicked on your message about three times, honey, and it hasn't want to come up. So you would like a card, certainly. I think I've probably shuffled them enough while we've been talking. Okay, beautiful, got something there clicking. That's all good. All right, I get the 35 is eight. I'm first of all drawn to finance, honey, and I get the flow with that. So I feel like I've got... Um, more money coming in I also feel that you are very grounded at the moment and anchored in so you are right where you need to be don't forget to keep your eye on the bigger picture is the reference I'm getting with that card because I do feel that it is about working towards what it is that you've been wanting for a while okay so I wish you all the very best with that as well okay lovely changes coming in is the reference I get and uh, let's hold Okay, Ruby says, Jessica Hardy, that is a whole telephone number. Haha, <laughs> you're having a conversation in the background. Beautiful. All right. Hi, Jessica. I'll say hi with you while I'm there. <laughs> okay. Hey, gorgeous Tony. She says, Hi, beautiful. When do you see me move? As we haven't found a house to rent. Yes, July, I get, honey. So to me, I do feel that that will be around July. And thank you for sharing the love. Okay. Excellent. So um, I get it's going to be a positive move, hun. And I feel like you're going to stay in that place for quite a while. Hey, Ashley, hope you're well, honey. Uh, good morning, evening from Canada. Beautiful. So, um, Canada, Perry, sounds, please, please, can I have a card or a message from Spirit, please? And thank you. Of course you, honey. Of course you can. It helps if I use my words in the right order. 
what is the confusion around you, honey, at the moment? I just sort of feel like you need to stop and sort of focus. There's a little bit of tiredness around you in that way. You're heading in the right direction. I get, I'm get. i drawn to getting the wind in your sails. So whether you've been feeling a little bit flat lately, I just get the reference to it is about pushing along in that direction. You are on the right pathway. Sometimes it might not always seem it because I feel that you question that at times as well. So I get the reference to just trust in that. Find that energy, find that way of moving forward. And when you do, you're going to move forward quite quickly. This is your time now, honey all right uh you are very welcome honey i just love the way i'm clicking on messages and other ones are coming up okay all right <coughs> excuse me let me click on this and see what happens why i wet my throat Okay, uh, good. Jessica says, good evening, lovely lady. I'd just like to hear what the divine spirits want me to know, see, hear, do. Thank you, shared from Melbourne. Thank you, honey. All right, I get you've got your own intuition, honey, and I feel that is changing at the moment. So I get the, you have to excuse my Facebook messages that are coming through and beeping. Um, so I get the reference to, it's about putting that trust in your, in yourself. I get, honey, you got a big heart and you do a lot for others. The focus needs to come back on you. You also need to do the writing in that side of it. So I want to say ground yourself, breathe and centre and put what's in your mind onto paper because I get you've got a lot of ideas. I feel that writing is going to make come into something bigger later on with that, okay? But this year needs to be about you, okay? I also see the number seven around you, okay? I get that it is about connecting with the numbers um, in a divine way is the reference that they just made. So I'm not sure what that means to you, but I just get the reference to connect with the number seven. Look at those things being put in front of you and trust within, okay? you got beautiful energy, honey. I like your energy. All right. Kayla, hey, gorgeous. She says, hi, Leanne. I'd love to know if you can see any more children from my husband and I in the future. Thank you. I want to put another child around you, honey. Just one more. All right, actually drawing to a little girl energy there as well. Okay. Uh, Marina says, hi, Leanne, I keep seeing 11, 11. Is there anything coming from my past loved ones? Okay, now I think I just said hello to you, not answered in that way. I've got male energies around you, honey, and I feel like I want to say two with that. I feel like I've got a, a grandfather and a pop okay so whether you call one grandfather and one pop or papa i just get the reference to very much uh around you in that way i feel that you sense spirit at night time when you're sleeping so whether you get a bit restless at night and you feel that something wakes you up but, and like i want to say not quite startled but comes out of that deep sleep i get the reference to they connect and give you the messages through your sleep as well in your dreams in that way okay i also want to acknowledge the birthday that has been or about to be so in the last couple of weeks or um the next sorry i'm just doing two things at once or within the next four to six weeks okay so spirit is just sending the birthday which is there as well so wishing you all the very best honey okay all right let's hope i've got it this time now oh, i managed to get it um it was jumping off the screen as I clicked on it. Um, okay, so Mel says, hey, Leanne, my question was, do you see me having any more children? Yes, I do, honey. I do sense, um, I want to say two around you, okay? So wishing you all the very best. Okay. Uh, okay, Rashina, I've done yours. Dana, hey honey. Uh, Dana says, hope you're well. I am, thank you. Uh, am I well enough to stable to get? Yes, yes. I think, honey, that will help you um, find some balance because you've got something to focus on, something to um, 
yeah to me it's the focus it's taking it's not you've got so much time on your hands you're very much a thinker honey and that's where I feel that brings that imbalance in your mental health side of it so yes I do feel that I want to say three days a week get find something that would be around three days a week and even if it's only a few hours a day it's going to help you bring balance back into your life and give you something to to focus on in that way so wishing you all the best honey okay tina says hey leanne anything from dad plays i kept the whistling so i don't know if you remember dad whistling or you hear the whistle at time i do get the reference to the he lets you know that he's around you there what is it that you're changing in the house or wanting to move around okay because he's wanting me to acknowledge the need for change with that okay he shows me he's there and he hears you talk to him so please know when you talk to your dad whether you're talking out loud or it is through your mindset, your thoughts, um, that he answers you back. So I always say, trust what you feel, think, see, hear, you know. All right, so wishing you all the best, honey. Um, there's a lot of love that comes through from Dad as well. Thank you, Sharon. You are very welcome, honey. It is my pleasure. Christine says, share the love, and Nikki Palmer has joined in with us. Hey, Nikki. Thank you, Christine, for sharing, and thank you, Nikki for that and actually um that's something that i'm looking at rewarding people on my new website is having a referral service on there where you can earn yourself some discounts and stuff for yourself and your friends but that isn't there just yet it will come with my new website i'm looking at ways i can give back to you guys in in certain areas as well so um those that follow me and help me spread the love excellent so thank you christina for that hey taylor she says hi leanne They're in the new house now yay uh do you, sorry guys about the beeping there's a group chat that i'm in and they're having a conversation do you think i should start school straight away and will it be in smooth transition? Yes and yes, honey. I get that you need other people around you around the same age. So I feel that you've shut yourself off a little bit. But yes, good. Um, I get the move. The new house is positive. And I feel like I want to get back into routine as quickly as possible. Okay. You'll be fine. Don't doubt yourself, honey. You're strong okay so wishing you all the best there okay tiffany says hi leanne can i please have a relationship reading i get a heavy heart around that honey um and i feel that my heart is blocked as well as my throat chakra so whether through relationship you've been hurt in the past and you need to open up the your heart space and let that loving light out as well as speak out because I feel all of a sudden as much as my heart is feeling heavy and blocked so is my throat chakra the throat chakra is around communication so whether you find it hard to speak up or you're not being heard in the way that you need to I just get the reference to it, it is really about the communication and allowing people in and don't be so guarded in that way okay i get love and joy coming your way so i feel that it's positive in that sense okay all right so wishing you all the best with that uh karina hey honey certainly you can have a card I just lost half the pack on the floor, but that's okay. So these three are the ones that um, have stuck out. The first one <laughs> I did well was the male, the relationship. So I want to say look at the relationship and I get new beginnings in that. So whether you're in a relationship at the moment and there's new change, new connection, or there's a new relationship coming. So if you're in one now, I just feel that we're moving into a different energy that's new and it's exciting in that way, okay? And I also get the reference to um, the news coming. So to me, I feel like there's something in paper form. I actually want to say look at the contract. So what is it that you're doing 
in or looking at in the way of contract related okay you're right where you need to be and i get you've got a good foundation to build on all right so you're heading in the right direction as well i feel there's financial gain around that at the same time so wishing you all the very best with that okay i'm going to put my cards down so i'm not fidgeting with them uh in that way um excellent so kelly kel says hello share the love a card please let me grab another set of deck or another deck of cards um okay thank you so spirit's giving me a message i don't think that's what i need to share just yet all right um as half my cards are on the other end of the floor or down there that's all right We'll go for bigger ones. All right. So, Kel, oh, I mean, I feel that you need to stop and breathe and just ground your energy at the moment. So just bring a little bit more balance into life. I just sort of feel like you're being pulled in different directions at the moment. And I love that. The card that comes out is meditation. All right. So ground, center yourself um, while you're taking those deep breaths. Stilling the mind is a pretty powerful thing, okay? So do the meditation and I get the rest will fall into place. All right, uh, Tonya, I don't think we've done one for you. Uh, Kat, they are wanting to jump off the table tonight. All right, so, okay, so the three cards that wanted to jump out for you, honey, I didn't even get a chance to shuffle them is the purify all right so to me i want to say it's cleansing um cleansing your surroundings cleansing those that stuff that is going on around you at the moment and i get clarity will come with that okay that clarity is going to bring balance that is going to open up your spiritual path as well so i do feel spirit is around you your intuition is more enheartened at the moment so i get it's really important to trust that at the same time okay all right next one we have chloe i think i've answered one for you honey but it says it's glitching out when you did my reading will i keep uh will you keep this video up yeah honey the video will stay up so you'll be able to go back and watch that side of uh okay nita says uh thank you leanne for your lovely message from my grandmother it's something to look forward to you are very welcome honey all right uh what's my mum saying ah she's saying hi to roz hi roz all right beautiful just a reminder if you're watching for, from any other page, Barn Leanne Winston Psychic Medium, uh, sorry, Barn My Time TV Dot Live, messages in the corner are putting me off, so I, I will make sure I silence them next time. All right, so if you're watching from any other page, Barn My Time TV Dot Live, please uh, do jump over here into my time. The link is in the comments above the video um, because I can't see your comments when you're on Leanne Winston Psychic Medium or any other uh, page that I have cross-posted to as well. All right. So beautiful. And don't forget to keep sharing and spreading the love at the same time. All right, Chloe. So hi, honey. She says, hi, Leanne. It's, uh, it's your first time here. Congratulations and welcome to the page. I would love to know about romance as I have had some trouble within the last year. Thank you so much. Would I be right, honey, in saying, Spirit's playing with my nose now. Would I be right, honey, in saying that you find yourself trying to be somebody to suit others so trying to fit into their world rather than them meet you halfway because i feel in a relationship you give so much more than you get back i get it, it's important for you to give yourself the credit as a, also demand the respect in the relationship and when you do you will stand as an equal and i get the reference to things will flow in the right direction speak up the throat chakra is a little bit blocked so i get the reference to it's important to speak up in the way that honors you as the the person that you truly are all right so wishing you all the very best there as well 
Okay, and we've got Deb next. Hey, Leanne, how are you doing? See me moving. Yes, but just not as soon as you would like to, honey. I do feel like I'm looking in a few months' time with that. Okay, so whether that is based more around the late this year or early next year, but I do see there will be a move. All right, so wishing you all the best. Brittany says, thank you, definitely will. You are very welcome, honey. It is my pleasure. All right, Adair says, funny you say that, I'm in the market for a new car, <laughs> beautiful. You'd be about the third one or fourth one now that I've heard in the last week, honey. Um, actually, I think you did tell me that last week when, when we had a conversation as well. So happy car hunting, hun. Um, I think I've done my share for now, but um, I could be interested in coming if you need help. Um, Ruby just says, will I heal and feel happy soon? Yeah, honey. Um, I get, okay, thank you. I get there's a lot of negative energy around you, honey, and you absorb that like a sponge. So to me, it's a feeling that you take on other people's energies at the same time. So it's really important for you to ground yourself and protect your energy. Now, I think that's a habit that we all need to get in because we have come out or been in this fear based energy with all the corona and everything else that's been going on the last probably eight or nine months. I just feel a lot of people have lent into that, okay? And it's funny because I've watched a lot of people moving into that energy and le leaning into that fear, but at the same time, I'm feeling myself pulled back from it and actually feel stronger for that. So it is kind of like we've got people leaning into that fear energy and we've got others that are just determined to step back and have taken advantage of this time to nurture themselves and grow and get like are ready to expand their wings, so to speak. So I just get some of this energy is negative energy that you're taking on around you. But don't forget the universal energy that has been going on for most of this year has been quite in heightened at the same time. So I do feel that, yes, you will. Okay. Something um, we had... Oh, last year? Yeah, it would have been last year. I had Dodd and Tolman on the show here with me um, as well. So if you can find the videos of Don Tolman and myself and another person that was in that, go back and have a look at that because he talks about the pinealian gland. I know I've said that wrong, but it's a gland in our head that is what causes, um, creates like the happy energy, the happy hormones sort of thing. And he spoke about having pineapple and orange mixed together um, and that is a trigger to activate that gland that will help bring that more positive energy in so I want to say think about that if you're somebody that struggles with um, feeling flat a little bit depressed and stuff like that or uh, more in that negative mindset Look at introducing, maybe in a smoothie, I sometimes do it, I put the pineapple, um, most mornings I have a smoothie with pineapple, but I've run out, but um, I'm having mango at the moment. I just put pineapple, if I've got oranges, I throw an orange into it, and I have yoga and LSA um, powder in it as well as some almond milk as well and I do find when I put the pineapple and the orange it's so much easier to stay in that happy uplifted sort of state as well so honey that might help you I wish you all the very best um, with that Izzy says card if there is time certainly you were in the chat beeping a moment ago where did you come from <laughs> I was getting all your messages come across the bottom of my screen, honey. Not that I could see what they were saying, but I could see you were chatting. And I hope you're doing well. All right, you've got the Provency card, honey. So with that card, I'm actually going to pull you a second card because with that, it means that it's in heightened, all right? And I can yeah, that's funny, the nature card as well. Now, I know you spend a lot of time down the beach and walking and stuff. So I do get it is about very much the connection. And I feel like I'm not just connecting with nature. I want to say animals as well with that. So anything that you 
while you're out in nature, while you're um, clearing your mind, look at those ideas that come up and they are very much enheartened by these, by the prophecy cards. So I just get the reference to it's now time to put things into action, all right? So to me, as much as I know you're sort of stuck here in our country while the borders are closed because you're from the US, I, um, I get the reference to it. it's about taking opportunities and doing that. Now, we do have to catch up with coffee, honey. I know um, I think I'm pretty busy next week, the week after I, if we get a time booked in, I can make that happen. All right, excellent. So, Let's see, Cass, yes, it caught your question before it jumped off my screen. Uh, Cass says, hi, Leanne, I hope you are well. Can I? Pl uh, can you please tell me what my mum thinks of my partner? And, oh, she likes him. And if she thinks I should spend, uh, send the letter to Paul, yes and yes, I got love. Um, love and light with that. Sorry, it helps if I do two, one thing at a time. So, honey, are you trying to do too much at a time? or trying to focus on a lot at once. I get, yes, mum likes your partner. He, he grounds you, he centres you, okay. I get he's got a very soft, loving heart. There's a very gentle side to him, but at the same time, he's very much a protector for you as well. So mum is quite pleased with that. I also get the reference to yes with Paul. Now, I feel that that is going to cause a little bit of friction, but it's energy that needs to be dealt with and let go of in that sense and I see it being much po more positive on the other side of that all right so I wish you all the very best and I kind of feel that relationship's got merits to where it's heading and I get the excitement around that okay uh Ashley says yes everything okay so obviously honey I I figured that's around your reading I can't remember what I said for you it's not my information to hold on to but thank you for that Tori says hi lovely is my auntie hanging around yes and I get she plays in your hair so to me I get the feeling it's just that gentle touch that you that you feel her energy there okay pardon me do you get indigestion so I want to say look at the food you're eating at the moment because I feel your body is reacting to something in that way. I know that's not what you asked me for, but I just need to acknowledge that. Okay. Uh, Cal, honey, I have done one for you. I know there's a bit of a... Um, a delay but yeah as she says i do laugh out loud okay thank you i don't think that was the answer to what i just asked you though and she is just saying a thank you uh okay rashina you have to go back and um watch that i was feeling that i had a little bit of a um a infection sort of thing and i also feel like i'm looking at foods around you so your body reacting to foods okay um kelly ann hey honey she says hi lovely i've jumped out of my comfort zone yay well done and started putting something i had thought about before but never never felt comfortable with I'm excited for you, honey. Is this going to build my confidence and be uh, a good thing? Yes, honey, I do think it is. Actually, do I want to go there yet? Okay, hon, I feel like you would be good, somebody um, good that I could work with, okay, because I feel that there's underlying things there that are blocking you in that way. So, um. It all comes down to timing. If it's meant to be, the right time will fall in place. I'm going to put it as that, okay? I've got some programs coming up. Uh, I'm thinking it's going to be a little bit delayed because of the changes I'm making in my workshop. But that's something, if the time is right and it's meant to be, will be put in front of you uh, later down the track and I would be honoured to work with through that stuff with you, okay? And that's... a. <laughs> Why does spirit do this to me? Okay. All right. So I, I know I did speak a little bit earlier on ways that I am changing my work. I am going to be releasing some programs where I will work with a selected few people and it will be like a six-month program. If you're interested, you can always inbox me and just let me know you're interested and when more details come available. 
uh, I'm certainly happy to to let you know of that. But what spirit is pushing me into is working with people to work through their fears and their blockages and stuff like that so they can actually move forward. So it's a lot more in depth than that, but I'm, I don't want to give away too much at once because I know there are people out there that are copying and watching what I'm doing and so be it. You know, obviously that's their journey. I don't have an issue with it, but I, when I would rather do it in more of a private setting. But keep an eye out. Like I said, the new workshop is coming. I'm hoping maybe within by the end of June, all that stuff will be up and running as well. So my poor tech guy, I think I'm, I'm going to give him grey hairs by the end of it. I love you, Nick. <laughs> all right. So Tori's just saying hi. Hi, honey. I hope you are doing well. And uh, Nita says you can save the video by clicking on the three little white dots up on the right hand side of the screen. Thank you, Nita. Appreciate that. And it will bring up the option to save. I think you can also download it too, um, as well. So if you don't have the save button, there will be a download button, it'll be one or the other. Uh, you can watch it after land. Yeah, I don't take these videos down, they do stay up here on uh, my time forever. Once they're live, they're live, we can't take them down sort of thing because that imprint's already left behind some videos are up on my youtube channel and you can certainly jump over there and subscribe to that as well i do had to that's a job i can get my husband doing i do want to take these lives each week and actually upload into my youtube channel and with changes that are going to happen in the next over the next probably three to four months that is one place that every uh week's show will go there as well all right. I just feel like I've got so much. I think I've done that one. I feel like I've got so much information and stuff that I'm really excited about that I just want to go blur and share it all. But I know um, Nick will kill me <laughs> if I get too far ahead because that will put more pressure on him to do his thing so I can actually get people into it. But keep your eyes peeled. That's all I can say for now. I am trying very hard to keep my mouth shut. <laughs> okay. Emma says, hi, Leanne, first time view here. Hey, honey, welcome. Thanks for sharing these messages. Can you please tell me who is around my son? I actually get a grandfather figure for uh, him. So whether I've got your grandfather or his grandfather stepping in, I do feel like it is a strong male. Okay. My feeling is that you sense that smell you get a whiff of a smell at times and that is spirit that is doing it. Your son sits there and I get the reference to the chatter um, with that side of it. So I do feel that your spirit, your son is very aware of spirit in that sense. He's quite intuitive. I feel that he gazes like he, he gets caught or you will catch him just gazing into space sort of thing, glaring into space in the sense that he's just so set on that one point in that side of it okay that is him sensing spirit okay i also get the numbers around your son as well so i feel he will be good with numbers okay or very much drawn to the numbers all right beautiful <coughs> excuse me throat's getting a bit dry from talking all day <laughs> all right i uh, wonder says hi leanne shared the uh, love card please certainly i actually did click on jessica's message to say thank you beautiful you are very welcome jessica it is my pleasure whoa there we go okay wonder i want to say look at the legacy that you have been leaving the the mark that you have been making in the last two years with that okay you need to give yourself credit because just to get those words out was hard so to me it's a feeling you don't give yourself the credit that is needed and looking at what you have achieved over the time all right so it's all very much based around uh, the legacy with you okay so wishing you all the very best um okay so helen hey honey i hope you're doing well okay all right manifest look at what you are wishing for honey 
I actually feel like I want to say be careful what you're asking for at the same time because I get the reference to what you put your mind to, what you put out there is exactly what you're getting back in at the moment. So keep it positive, keep it focused on the same things and don't change your mind because that's where I believe if we keep changing our mind on what we're wanting or questioning ourselves, we bring in that doubt as well. Okay, so uh, manifestation for you, honey. Okay, Marina, <coughs> oh, excuse me, is saying yes, definitely beautiful. Please, that resonates with you, honey. Uh, let's see if I grab Jasmine's. Yep. Uh, hey, Leanne, how are you? Are there any messages from my brother, please? It's his one year since his passing this Friday. Okay, I get the feeling, honey, that you're not looking towards uh, looking towards Friday in the sense that um, it's bringing up a lot of heartache, a lot of grief for you as well. Sorry, those notifications. Um, so I do get the reference to feel the love, know that he is very much at peace and very much around you, okay? He's got his hand on his heart, which is my sign for love and pride for you. He knows how much he is missed and I actually feel that he whispers in your ear at times. So whether there's times that you've felt that tingle, that bit of a breeze to your right ear, I get the reference to that he um, very much communicates with you in that way and lets you know that he is around you okay so wishing you all the very best okay um dana says thank you spot on focus which i'm i'm noticing lately well done honey all right so uh my time it's been a fun day i think that's Roz putting that comment in there sorry i'm just going to mouthful All right, I'm <clears throat> sorry, I'm getting dry. I'm sitting right under the heat event, nearly under it, and it um, it's flying straight in my face. All right, Jeannie, hey, I hope you're doing well, hum. All right, and I'm going to say keep up the good work. So I don't know what the changes, mate, is that you're going through lately, but I just get the reference to keeping up the good work, okay? Karen says, can you pull me a car, please? Certainly, honey, I would be very... Happy to do that, and it's going to jump out at us. Okay, protection. All right, so I want to say just protect your energy. Look at the energies around you. So I actually feel with your energy, honey, you've been feeling a little bit flat and tired lately. All right, so put that protection in place so you're not taking on all their energy in that sense. All right, Um I don't know why. Yeah, it's all about negative. I don't know why I was being drawn to that. Um, actually, I do. It just says on the bottom of it, it talks about negative energy, but the card says you are the warrior on the path of enlightenment. Trust your intuition. Be strong. That's what I, I was being drawn to, those last two sentences there. For some reason, Spirit told me to read the bottom of the card. So whether that makes re like that um, refer... <laughs> That resonates with you at the moment and you need to hear that. You need that reminder. I just get the reference to there is negative energy around you. You need to protect yourself. But reminding you that you are the warrior on that enlightenment pathway and that you are strong. All right. So wishing you all the very best in that way. Okay. All right. Excellent. And Jeannie just says, any messages from dad has had a few dreams Pardon me, and not sure what uh, the message is. Okay, would I be right in saying you're a little bit settled, unsettled around the stomach in area, Jenny? Um, I get the reference to you holding on to energy there. So whether you're finding yourself being a little bit bloated or that indigestion side of it, okay? Dad says focus on you. There's changes coming in around you. He's proud of the work that you have done. He makes me feel that you have been on a roller coaster in the past. You've done a lot of, I want to say, self self discovery, self soul level work and he just shows me that he's proud of you mate so i get the hand on the chest which is my sign for love and pride you're heading in the right direction he makes me feel that you are surrendering rather than trying to make things happen which is going to allow that flow to keep going all right 
So I do wish you all the very best there and there's a lot of love that comes through. Okay, beautiful. All right. We have Amanda, spread the love. My first grand, oh, exciting grandbaby due in four weeks. Do you see a boy or a girl and is there any names coming through as they still are undecided? Okay. Uh, I'm drawn to a boy with that energy and I actually feel like I get a B reference with that. Now, I'm not huge on names. Um, I actually feel like I've got a bit of a unique name in with the letter B in that sense, okay? So wishing you all the very best and exciting times ahead. I love baby news. Uh, <laughs> is he? Yes, honey, I am feeling the love. <laughs> I love that. Is this one of the people in the conversation that keeps coming up on the bottom of my page? And Gina says, hi, Leanne. I hope you're well. Would love a card, please. Certainly we will do that. Now, guys, just a, remind, um, a reminder, don't forget to help spread the love. And if you're watching this as a replay, you can share this. You can watch, what do watch parties, whatever. Um, invite your friends and family to join in because you never know when one of the messages here resonate with um, somebody. I just keep getting told, share the love. Got to go further okay protection honey so you've got the protection card as well i actually feel at the moment is about bringing the center back in around you with that side of it i also get the reference to you're stronger than you give yourself credit with that so when you're centered and you're focused you are protected in that way so when you when you're not focused, I feel like your energy is here, there and everywhere. So I do feel that it is very much about bringing that protection back in and guarding yourself in that way, okay? So wishing you all the very best in that. Dana, you are very welcome. It's my pleasure. Taylor, you're very welcome too, honey. It's my pleasure. I love your energy, Taylor, as well, okay? All right, um, Izzy saying hi, Tanya. Beautiful, hey, Tanya. Okay, uh, Christine, I'm pretty sure I've done one for Kel. You're very welcome to, honey. It's my pleasure. Chantel, I don't think I've done one for you tonight, honey. All right, I'm going to, because you're asking for guidance, I'm going to draw a card for you. Now, Spirit's making me feel like I've got to take one from both packs all right so let me just grab that put them down split the deck and go that one <laughs> okay infinity all right so to me i feel like it is about coming together it's the reuniting i feel like i've got that overlap sort of feeling back you are the center point everything will balance out but i get the reference to watching oops it's upside down Watching those around you because I do feel people are ready to, to strike at times. So just protect yourself. Keep that sort of shield up. Keep that focus on you and I get the rest will fall into place. All right. So wishing you all the very best. You will have to excuse my cat Dobby, my daughter's cat Dobby. Um, <laughs> he's decided that he wants to go outside and his mum's not listening, obviously because she's probably too busy watching the telly all right tanya, tanya you are very welcome honey it is my pleasure uh okay jessica just says dobby sorry my cat is scratching at the carpet jessica just says yes chloe hardy reading leanne you are spot on beautiful all right thank you uh my mum says, hi, Leanne, do you see Friday being positive? I told you that on the phone, mum. Yes. Don't stress. Paul, can you let the cat out, please? No. <laughs> that was an answer. <laughs> no. <laughs> All right. Excellent. Um, Jenny's saying hi to Chris. Beautiful. Pineal, thank you, Izzy. I knew I was saying it wrong. The pineal gland that pineapple is good for. Pineapple and orange. All right. Uh, what she say? Yes, 
uh, orange is fantastic for mood elevation. Yeah, that's why they, I reckon they give it to all the kids on the sports field. And yeah, drink over pineapple juice. Okay, excellent as well. Vitamin C and yeah, beautiful. Thank you, honey. All right. Um, okay. All right. I think I might leave it there. I know there is um, Rashina. Uh, thank you, Leanne. Love and light. Love and light to you too, honey. Thank you very much. All right. So there's a lot of thank yous here. So you're all very welcome. It is my pleasure. All right. All I ask in return is that you help me spread the love. Um, invite let your friends and family know if they're new to my page get them to like it and if you're new here on mytimetv.live don't forget to hit the like button on there as well because we, uh, Adair is doing a very good job and building up a really lovely community of broadcasters and there's a lot of interesting shows happening and about to happen now just a reminder put the number eight in the comment as well now you can do that even after i end the broadcast but that will put you into our bot system so myself the lovely Roz Bounty and Adair Palmer are running our online expo. Our next one is on the 7th of June, which is a Sunday, and it's 10 a.m. to 4 p.m. So we have a whole range of gorgeous stall holders or business, small businesses that will be presenting you with their products, telling you about their services. And some of those lovely stall holders are actually offer, offering giveaways to the audience as well. So so um, if you go into my Psychic Me and Winston Psychic Medium business page, you will see in the events there is an event there for Lifestyle ex um, what is it? Lifestyle Psychic and Wellness Expo. Um, you can hit the you know it going on that. Join in on my time TV on the 7th of June. If you are a small business or um, a store holder and would like to promote yourself, you can certainly can contact me by inboxing me or um, Ros Bounty or Adair Palmer for more information on that. So by putting the eight in the comments, you will go into our lovely bot and she will keep you updated on what is coming. We have a magazine with still like the businesses that are involved in that as well um, and what they are doing. So just put the eight. If you if you don't get it, it means you've already registered. If uh, you know you haven't registered and you didn't get it, please let us know. Uh, it is called technology and occasionally things can happen with that. Uh, Nita is just saying, well, something is coming through on your face, Leanne. <laughs> okay, that could be energy because I can actually feel the energy sitting here um, as well with that. So you've got to love the way that spirit plays. Ah, Tina, I got, I, um, I thought I was seeing something on Leanne's face too. Wow. Okay, I love it. I love the way you guys are picking up on that. When I'm actually working and I do live shows and stuff, quite often people in the crowd uh, or the audience, I should say, will take photos of me while I'm channeling and quite often they can pick up energy or orbs and stuff. And I love doing things like that with my students in some of my workshops where I actually pull spirit in and they can see the energy around me in the background and stuff like that. So it is pretty fascinating. Spirit is in heightened a lot lately and um, I just, I love the more physical stuff that comes through as well with spirit. All right, I'm going to leave it there. This cat is dying to get outside in the cold and the wet and everybody else seems to be ignoring him at the moment. So I'm going to say good night. Thank you so much for joining me. Remember, there are going to be a lot of changes coming over the next couple of months. So keep your eyes out for those and some workshops and stuff like that. I'm really excited and looking forward to all these changes that will come in. You may even find the name of my Psychic Medium page, my business page, is going to change as well very shortly. So it doesn't mean that I'm not going to be here to do this stuff. I'm just going to be working in a different way and taking things to a much higher level. I want to have uh, help people with their breakthroughs in life as well, and that is all going to be done intuitive at the same time as other things that I've had going on for a while. So I 
look forward to seeing where it takes us and connecting with those beautiful souls in the future. Welcome to everybody. Ah, Kelly screenshotted it. Excellent. Maybe inbox it to me, honey. Thank you. I'd love to see it and let you know what I pick up on it. I do feel it is a male energy though. Uh, thank you, honey. She's going to send it to me. All right. Dobby's saying good night. He's telling me to get off because he's at the door. Take care of yourselves. Enjoy. Remember to honour yourself but also honour those around you and be the best version of you that you possibly can. Sending love and healing to those that would like it and I'll see you next week. Bye for now.